is Goddess Tea, Miss Goddess Tea. And I am going to do the December forecast for Capricorn. It's your card. Can I get the December forecast for Capricorn Spirit World, please? a present energy and the energy to come. And this is for Capricorn for December 2018. Should we put it back in or should we take them? Let's take them. Oh, we got four cards, so let's put them back in. So I'm looking for three cards. is the Queen of Swords. Present energy, Five of Wands. Future energy, the Lover's card. Okay, so for your past energy, Capricorn, I see you being very firm, standing very firm in a situation. Using your voice. For the Five of Wands, maybe in some conflict presently, multiple people, a lot of opinions flying around. And then we have this, the Lovers, in the Future position, which is a Soulmate card. So let's clarify to get a kind of clearer view of what's going on here. We clarify the Queen of Swords, please, Spirit Guides. Clarify the Queen of Swords, please. Let's give this a shuffle. There you go, Capricorn. I'm over this reading. We have the Fool, Two of Chalices, and then the Judgment card. So I think in the past you might have gotten into a, a disagreement where you had to voice your opinion, stand up for what you believe in in the past. Um, you had to go off on your own way with the Fool card. You stood your ground and, and put your foot down. Queen of Swords has that energy. Cuts through the BS. The Five of Wands. Can we clarify the Five of Wands? Please, Spirit Guides. Spirit World. Okay, we 
have the Knave of Wands. Three of Chalices. And the King of Swords. So again, we have the Swords energy. Um, standing firm. Might be standing firm right now in the midst of all the kind of just wouldn't say chaos but disagreements going around you you're still going out and enjoying yourself the three of chalices I kind of get more that you're going out and, and enjoying yourself maybe with other other friends possibly right now That energy from the past you're putting on the back burner right now. Can we clarify the lover's card, please, for your guides? Clarify the lover's card. Swords, the Nine of Pentacles, and the Two of Swords. Got a lot of Swords energy in this reading. I don't know if you guys are dealing with an air sign. Um, just throwing that out there. Lois wants to come into the reading again. Hello, Lois. Say hello. Yeah. Okay. So with this, I'm seeing in the future, possibly communication. You're gonna have to make a, a decision. You're, you're thinking about maybe what those people have said about the situation presently, what's going on, the different opinions around you, or just the fact that there's not a, a stable kind of environment around you right now, as far as people go. There's not a agreement. Everybody's in disagreement. So maybe you're making a decision in, in the future that has to do with your soulmate, but I feel like, you know, you got everything you need in the future. So, this decision is really one that is going to be about how you feel in the relationship. Which you should be, you know, you should have that self-love, which you acquired. You have, you have a stable financial environment, emotionally, you know, you've gotten, you've grown. So this decision in the future is definitely coming about with a soulmate in the future. That's what I'm thinking, Capricorn. Let's see here. Seems like some good energy. In the future. I'm liking it, Capricorn. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in January.